In the previous lesson, I covered in detail the various view options that allow me to view my clips in the bin. Now, I'd like to cover another subject concerning the bin window, and more specifically with these folders. I'll show the folder structure again, and I can see that all of my clips shown in the view window are located in the root folder. I have a few more folders, however, and these also contain certain clips. I'll change back to the root folder in order to show you some extra options for sorting and searching for clips. So basically, I'd like to organize my clips somewhat better. And to do this in EDIUS, there is a very nice function which I can call up via this eyeglass here, which is the search function. If I click on this from my root folder, a bin search window opens and I can see that I can search by category. For example, by clip name. And if I type a name here, for example, ice, and then use the add button, a new folder appears in my bin. At least it looks like a folder, but it is in reality a dynamic search folder, and it contains the results of my search. And we can see that it contains two clips, both of which have the word ice in their title. I'll close the search window and have a look in this folder called Tour, and I'll choose any clip. For example, this one. And I'll rename it by clicking F2, and I'll call it Ice Cold. And now, if I go back into my search folder, we can see that this clip now appears in the search folder as well, which tells me that the search folder updates itself automatically. If something changes in the project, the search folder will always be up to date in showing me the clips that are relevant to my search criteria. I could create many search folders and name them to suit their criteria by right mouse click, rename, ice clips, and so I have a search folder that will always show me clips that contain the name ice. This clip is not actually needed in this search folder, as it was just to show how the folder works. If I wish to remove it from here, I have to take care as deleting it will delete it not just from the search folder, but from my project. So if I wish for it to no longer be shown in the results, I can rename the clip. This however cannot be done directly from the search folder. I have to go to the original file and rename it there, for example, Tor4 and now it no longer appears in my search results.